So if you have minimal equipment, but you're still looking for a way to get stronger, better condition, and have the ability to defend yourself, I got you. Check this out. So we're gonna warm up with 10 minutes of jump rope. Now we're gonna do 100 reps of knee strikes. So that's 50 reps each leg. One cue I like to remember is thrusting your hip into the knee strike. Put your hip into it. Don't just raise your knees up. This is not a cardio kickboxing class. I like to use drills that I can really implement at real life situations. Focus on controlling the movement and perfecting your technique. My technique is not perfect, I know, but I'm working on it. So imagine grabbing someone on the back of the head, clench down and throwing knee blows either to the body or to the head. Now here's a good drill for neck strength. Find an anchor point for a resistance band Wrap it around your head, walk forward till you feel tension. Now that you feel the isometric tension in your neck, you could just stand here, or you could turn your head sideways, or you could turn your body sideways to work the side of your neck. You could turn your head backwards, turn to the other side. So you can do 30 seconds of head twists, 30 seconds on the sides, and 30 seconds in the back. Now we're gonna do weighted pistol squats. Use support if you have to, it's all right. Drop the fucking ego. Three sets of five reps for each leg. Now we got elevated handstand pushups. Start off with one rep, work your way up to five reps then back down to one rep. Or you can do pike push-ups. Now we got burpees. So we're gonna do a ladder set of 12 reps and work your way down to one rep. So now we have the ab wheel. The weight vest is optional, of course. So I'm gonna work my way up to between 75 to 100 reps. Rest whenever you need to. So that's it for the workout. If you enjoyed this workout, give me a like, comment, share, and I'll catch y'all on the next video. Let's go.